Hello everybody and welcome back to WoW Mods. And so we're here and this is going to be not a show off video, although uh, this top part here has had a considerable amount of work uh, done to it. Um, what we're actually going to be talking about today is I'm going to be providing you all with uh, the link to the Nogget version that I'm currently using, uh, as well as some additional tools that I hope to also include in this package. Um, so make sure to check uh, down in the description section of the video. You'll find that the links uh, there. No guarantees um, on if anything will work for you. You're going to have to sort of like figure things out, but those are the files nevertheless. Uh, so right now, I guess we're just going to go ahead and hop straight into Nugget. Hello everybody, and now we're in Nogget, and as you can see, this is the Nogget that is in the file underneath in the link. So this is the version that I'm currently using. Um, so this is Nogget Studio version 3.35a, uh, uh, and this particular version of Nogget is 3.1408. Now, a couple of uh, weeks ago, I think, uh, somebody posted and told me and asked me why I was using the older version of Nogget. Um, as far as I had known, uh, this was what uh, a good friend of mine has, had sent me of the most stable uh, particular branch. Uh, and I hadn't bothered to go ahead and, and look at uh, newer versions of it. But uh, anyways, as soon as I actually get that, uh, if I see that there's a newer version that it's actually working a lot better, uh, I'll go ahead and switch uh, to that. Or even if you're watching this video now and you can actually tell me where to get the newer version, not a problem. Just go ahead and leave it, uh, leave the link in the, um, in the comments down below. All right, so this is the uh, loading screen of Nogget. It'll change depending on the race screen. Uh, it's a little bit random. Um, and so here we have sort of like a division of all the land masses. Uh, that are available uh, in the game. Sometimes it crashes, uh, so if that happens, I'll let you know. But, um, for, for example, when you click on the Eastern Kingdoms, here you can see that it's all uh, looks like it's all been edited. Uh, that's because I was constantly working around this area with different things. Uh, but if we go into Kalimdor, here for example, you can see nothing has been edited. So I've altered nothing on the Kalimdor side of the map. Uh, I believe if we go to Outland, it's the same deal. I have no 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 content there, um, and you can go into like different things as well. You can also go into, for example, um, Escape from Durnhold, and you have the sort of like the uh, Caverns of Time version of Hillsbrad. Um, anyways, you have a lot of like uh, different places. Uh, dungeons and raid and raid is where I'm currently working at right now because I'm working on this unused map of the Emerald Dream and as you can see it is a very large map um, and though it says that it's all been played with that's not really the case it's just a little uh, issue there that I had but I am building probably everything around this section of the map so if I click here and then go uh, get max IUD because of a problem with uh, duplications. I'm taken to this part of the map, and lo and behold, uh, here we have the actual um, uh, Night Elf uh, Suramar uh, ruin city that uh, we were working on before. Uh, and it's all there, it's all good to go. Um, we can see it from afar. And yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty interesting. Now uh, here we go. Here and these are some other elements. I'm actually thinking about turning this into my own particular version of uh, a loon's temple. So I need to corrupt all this area, make like a green fell uh, thing, and have it somewhat close to that area. But that's sort of like. Uh, down the road. Um, a little bit further down through here, uh, we can also find uh, different oh, different work. So here, for example, obviously we have uh, my Colteris map right now, and this is pretty much um, what I've been working on right now. 
I'm just showing you kind of from afar. I might actually, after this... Oh, what was that? A little notification. Um, so after this, I might actually go in and uh, show you some of this uh, firsthand. Uh, so I think I, I think I'll just jump ahead because I'm not going to go through like the very details. I just wanted to have a little bit of content to show you uh, as to uh, what it is that I'm going to um, be working on, and also to give you the link to uh, my version of Nuggets. So now let's jump into uh, World of Warcraft and let's take a look at this in game. All right, uh, and now we are inside uh, the patch. As you can see, there's still plenty of work uh, to be done. There's buildings kind of like hovering up in the air. Um, but there's been a great deal of work that's been done on that side of the island and a bit of work here. Um, so uh, it's interesting. I'm just going to look here at this and sort of like give you a, a nice little glance as to what's actually going on there. We might actually run uh, down over here as well and see exactly what's going on see if we can just peek right over there and yeah so you can see there's quite a bit of uh, work that's been done you can see the roads there down that way but I'll give you a full video of all of those changes um, somewhat in the future uh, there's still a couple of things that I'm trying to catch up on work has been a little bit crazy but I want to show you right now sort of like a little micro environment uh, that uh, that I that I was working on I sort of like it there's still a lot of like cleanup uh, working with the actual terrain making sure that all of that is uh, you know kind of like finalized um, and then you know you you uh, start working on on those like little micro environments uh, which is pretty cool so we're coming up to it right now. As you can see, I have to sort of like bring up some of this terrain and, and make this a little bit more uh, sensible. Um, it's currently just uh, all kind of like over the place, but here we go. So here we, we, we have uh, some of those micro environments that, 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 that I was talking about. So this is, you know, a little farm, uh, a little farm area. It's, it's yet to be uh, finished and, and worked on and realize that this all has to kind of be like a hill if it's going to be that way but um, you know when you look at something like this and you look at the framing and you see the trees and sort of like the detail work you, you go yeah this is pretty good this is this is what um, an area that is being developed should look like um, there's still a little bit more terrain work that needs to be done uh, perhaps some additional um, uh, texturing issues uh, and whatnot um, but yeah, so that's pretty much uh, as much as I'm sort of like willing to show you uh, right now. Um, work is slow. It's a very, it's a very large uh, area, and it's going to take time. Even for those of you who have seen the uh, the high elven patch, that took a very long time to get it to the state that it currently is. So it doesn't, you know, strike me as odd that this is going to take, uh, you know, a good bit, of, a good bit of time uh, to actually get it. Uh, looking the way we want it to look, but uh, from afar we can sort of look at the uh, the uh, castle and the uh, old town in that area, and uh, yeah, we get a sense of uh, exactly what's going to happen uh, in this particular area. And if you know, we go through here. There's more changes like that barn is going to disappear, and and we're going to make it look a little bit more uh, like a city because we, we decided to change the, the placement of, of farms uh, last minute. Um, yeah, and so if you come back here, you'll also see uh, some other elements that you hadn't seen because that part of the island I don't think was included. Oh, oh, we jumped. We, we, we decided to jump straight into the, um, uh, into, the, into the air and I was flying. Okay, let me take that off. And here we go. Um, so this is uh, one of the, the the port sections here. You can see another port section over there, uh, over there in that area. And I'm just gonna uh, come right up here and sort of like take a look uh, at that uh, fort there. And obviously the issue we're having right now with that particular bridge uh, over there. Um, but that's it. So. Uh, hopefully that will wet your whistle for the uh, next uh, episodes and the other side uh, when we go back to it. And then I'll probably come to this area as well. 
uh, once we're somewhat uh, sure of what's going on. Um, but until then, everybody, I hope you enjoy the file. I hope you enjoy uh, all the other additional elements that I'll be hopefully attaching uh, to the description. Um, and like I said, if you have if you have any more information, any more things that you actually just want to share with me, go ahead and leave it down in the uh, down uh, in the comments section down below. As always, remember to like and subscribe. And I'm taking a break because my my uh, my throat is a little bit uh, not the best right now. So until then, everybody, take it easy. Bye bye. <laughs>